What's going on guys? George with another video and welcome back to the channel. Right behind me, you already know my 2017 Toyota Tacoma. This is a truck that I've been building for about four years and a half now. Bought its stock and it's pretty much evolved to what it is today. Now I have been documenting everything that I've done to this truck on this channel. You can always go down below and just go through all the videos that I've done. But in today's video, we're going to be talking about one of the most effective functional mods that I've done in the interior of my truck but I did want to take the time to kind of you know use it for a while make sure that it's a good mod for me to make a video on and let me tell you something this has definitely been a game changer for the Toyota Tacoma especially the interior of the Toyota Tacoma so enough said let's get into the video we're gonna throw some solid music in the background some b-row and check out what I recently did let's get into it But here we have it, the main menu, Apple CarPlay will automatically launch because my phone is plugged in. But let's go back to the home area. So in the main section of the menu, I mean, pretty straightforward. You have all your different options from Apple CarPlay to your radio, Bluetooth, XM radio, HDMI, AVN, your cameras, everything is pretty much there. If we scroll down, we do have the ability to turn it off just like so. And uh, also navigation is integrated as well. So this is a, an extra option that you can have if you do want to have navigation, which is pretty useful, especially if you are going to be traveling without reception. In my case, I do that a lot. But the main focus of this radio that pretty much just sold me was the Apple CarPlay. This thing is absolutely killer. The colors are vibrant. I mean, everything looks really good. And the ability to be able to go on your messages, have everything right in front of you without being distracted by your phone. I mean, it's it's a big plus. Now, another selling point for me was the ability to have multiple cameras. Uh, in my case, I only have my rear um, connected, but I do eventually want to do a front camera which is probably gonna say no signal, yep. You can put cameras on the left and on the right. And this is very important, very useful when you're out hitting trails. Uh, let's see what else was a selling point. This section was a big selling point for me as well, uh, which was the sound settings. Check it out, guys. So you can have your basic, um, you know, fade, loudness, sub, uh, everything this is basically what the stock radio would have and then the equalizer is always very limited on the Tacomas or any type of Toyota but look at this guys now you can pretty much change everything from the highs the mids the base the low mids mid-range I mean everything is here and the touchscreen is actually very responsive as well crossovers if you want to limit the mids in the front of the vehicle or the rear of the vehicle. I mean, everything is here. Time correction, which in my case, it doesn't really apply because it is a smaller truck, but if you have a big truck, I mean, you can tweak this out and make it sound absolutely beautiful. So everything else, like I said, background options. I mean, this is all standard here. So now another option that you do have when you don't have Apple CarPlay available or you don't want to use Apple CarPlay, you can also use your Bluetooth to stream your music or to even talk on the phone. So as soon as you remove Apple CarPlay, the Bluetooth capability becomes available even with your phone, just like so. And uh, I mean, this is definitely, definitely a great thing to have when you are traveling. You don't want to be on your phone at all times. But for the most part, guys, everything is right in front of you, literally. You're one touch away from all these different options. The fact that this has a 10 inch screen as well. I mean, it just looks a lot better. It definitely improves the experience when you're inside the truck. The sound system on this sounds a lot better. You do have endless options as far as 
the technicality that you can get or you can do as far as the sound system but man i don't know why but toyota has definitely always lagged as far as technology goes i'm so grateful for companies like these that create products that are quality that can definitely improve the interior portion of the Tacoma. Overall, I do rate this radio probably an 8 out of 10. And the reason why I'm not giving it a 10 out of 10 is because in my opinion, there's a few things that definitely do have to be improved. And it has nothing to do with the radio itself. I think it's more of a software update. Uh, on the Jeep JL JK, you do have the option of having an OBD2 reader that tells you uh, pretty much the pitch or angle uh, of the truck tire pressure and for the Toyota Tacoma since it's not yet released that option is not available I'm sure like I said all it needs is an update not only that but when you do have your camera options and you hit that reverse section there is kind of a four second lag just like so I really do wish that this would be more flowy especially because the first thing you do when you get in your vehicle is you turn it on you hit the reverse if you're going to be backing up and the fact that you have to wait four seconds before you can actually see what's behind you uh, you know it's definitely not a deal breaker but it definitely needs improvement uh, but aside from that everything is pretty solid the colors are all there very very bright uh, vibrant uh, I'm sure the camera is probably not capturing how well the colors look in person. But, I mean, that's pretty much it. I mean, I'm yet to try the HDMI, the USB option. I think that's definitely going to improve and make my experience a lot better. But, so far, I'm loving this thing. I definitely do recommend it to you guys that have Tacoma. Uh, Tacoma's with the regular small little screen, or the JBL option. This is definitely a lot better guys so let's go back outside talk a little bit about this specific setup and what you guys can do to achieve what i just did and possibly install it on your tacoma so when it comes down to the stinger off-road brand and not only that but the head unit or even all their products i mean this is a company that has been around for a long time if you go on forums go on youtube even go on instagram i mean these guys are big dogs have been around for a long time so the reliability and the customer service of this company is pretty much top notch. I'm telling you this because this particular setup or application for the Toyota Tacoma, it's still not out yet. You know, they're supposed to be releasing hopefully July of 2021. But as soon as I saw this radio, I did hit them up and they told them, hey, listen, this is something that I definitely do want to try on my truck. I know it's available for the JK, the Jeep JK the Jeep JL and other applications, but I really, really wanted one for the Toyota Tacoma. So I hit them up. Sure enough, they had the specific harnesses that it needed. It had the brackets that it needed. And we basically just ordered everything in one shot. So with that being said, if you're wondering if this application is available as a kit for you to purchase, the answer is no. But what I'll be doing for you guys is I'll be linking everything down below in the description, everything that I bought to make this happen. So hopefully if you plan on buying this before it actually releases as a kit, you can order it. And let me tell you something, it's a huge game changer. It's gonna make the interior of your truck a lot better. Functionality wise, I mean, Apple CarPlay is just a game changer. The ability to be able to change the tuning settings on the audio itself, I mean, it's all there. So. As always, I want to thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys want to communicate with me, get in contact with me, ask me more questions about the radio itself, my Instagram will be down below. Shoot me a message or comment down below in the comment section and I'll do everything to my best of my ability to answer whatever questions you guys have. As always, I want to thank you guys so much for always watching. If you guys enjoyed this video, you already know what to do. Tell a friend about the radio, tell a friend about the channel, subscribe, and I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace.